that YouTube. It's your girl tonight, aka Life for Night, and I'm back with another YouTube video. So basically, in this video, it's gonna be hygiene tips, how to keep fresh and clean during quarantine. Ooh, that rhyme. During the summertime, during the winter time, all day long, all week long. All that okay period no need for that mm, smell okay so before i get into this video make sure you guys like comment subscribe to my channel and yeah let's just get into this so this video is just gonna be like not at all and i feel like we're gonna start from head down to the toes down to the toes this can go for male female whatever you is we need to stay clean period so starting from the head wash your hair no need for dirty dangerous smelling nasty hair your hair can start off as same it can and different people wash their hairs at different times but everybody knows gets to that point where it's like mm, my scalp real itchy you need to go wash it that's just that on that shampoo conditioner whatever use it you should wash hair a good two times in that that day when you decide to wash and then conditioner and detangle it and do all that you need to wash your hair next is just the face make sure you guys are washing your face in the morning at night whatever getting the crust out your eyes yeah wash your face face mask whatever you use on your face just wash your face man acne comes for everybody it happens during puberty whatever everybody gets pimples from eating bad and all that so make sure you wash your face drink water it really is good for your skin um everybody has different skin yes but drinking water is like the key for everybody i don't care and then y'all can figure out every other skincare routines that work for you but wash your face next we're gonna go to the ears lord have mercy i see some people with some dirty ears i don't understand i do not want to see the ear wax in your ear like no i'm not just staring in your ear but it be coming out people's ear like or they take the headphone out and it's just that that's not okay you get in the shower every day and you can take the washcloth and go inside your ear and go behind it too go up at the top you need to wash your ears. Is the teeth. I can't stress this enough. Teeth is important, man. If the teeth ain't right, that's that's an automatic turn off. And I feel like I don't want a female friend if your breath stink and your mouth is just, mm, just I can't. I'm sorry. At least take the time out. Two minutes. Two to four minutes, whatever the time frame is, whatever. But I know. The minimum is two minutes of brushing your teeth daily, two times. It's supposed to be two times, but now that not everybody do that. Okay, at least at least something, man. Take time out to brush your teeth, for real. Yeah, down to the upper area, you got your armpits and your chest and your stomach and all that. Everybody know we in the shower for the underarms, ladies. Please shave your underarms. Hair does keep an odor, if you didn't know. J just letting you know. So if you decide you want to go weeks and weeks without shaving, waxing, whatever your preference, nair, whatever, mm, it's just not okay. I don't find it cute to have hair underneath your armpits. I don't know about anybody else, but that's not me. And if you do choose to, that's like a quick way to get a nasty scent especially if it's hot and yeah um also use deodorant i use the spray the dry spray deodorant it works really good and it doesn't leave that white color but um secret is also good whatever you decide to use but put on some deodorant if you shower and you don't sweat much you don't have to wear deodorant but at least shave and just when you when you wash don't forget these okay those that is a place that can smell 
Also, make sure y'all wash your neck. Going down to the private area and your your little kitty, or you look, make sure you shave and make sure you go to to the Brazilian wax, European wax, whatever. Like I said, hair does leave an odor. Literally go in there because you will you will get some, especially if it's not Dove unscented soap. Y'all be going in there with Bath and Body Works. I'm talking about Victoria's Secret. No, no, that is not okay. That will throw off your pH balance and you will be smelling. Do not go inside of your, your kitty with that stuff. Your soap should not be smelling like you just walked out of the Bath and Body Works store. That is not okay. I know it, it, it gotta be burning. Let me know if it be burning. Don't use that stuff. Please don't. Use warm water and Dove. And I didn't say go in. Just go around and make sure everything is clean. Ladies, if you're on your monthly, make sure you shower daily. If you can, get in there two times a day. Get in there two times a day. Please, the rag that you, your washcloth, whatever you want to call it. Whatever you use when you on your monthly, once you're done with that, wash it. Wash it. Don't put that on your face. Don't put it nowhere else, man. Hurry up and wash it once you're done. That is nasty too. Please don't be using the same washcloth y'all using for y'all body to wash your face. Like that don't even sound right. So I hope y'all not doing that either. Next, you're behind. Make sure you're cleaning that too. And you're behind, you wiping from the front to the back. Never the back to the front. When you're going twinkle, or you going number two, or whatever you do, it's always the front to the back. You don't want all whatever is in behind there to come up here, because y'all, you don't want to hurt her. She's very gentle, okay? And you just want to be careful. Just don't get those two mixed up. Behind is separate from the front, okay? You don't you don't want to combine those two. It's not nice. And please, when you go on number two, make sure you're actually, like, doing it right. If you got wipes, honestly, if you have baby wipes at your house, you can use those, too. Like, I think about it like this. When I was a little girl and I was a baby and I was wearing diapers, we was all wearing diapers, my mommy used wipes on me and she got it all up clean really good with the wipes so right now day and age i use wipes to wipe my butt y'all using the nasty toilet paper and it's all dry and it's you leaving some i swear y'all leaving some back there still i swear y'all is but whatever my preference your preference whatever Please do it right. It's 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 like really sick. So down to the legs or whatever. Basically just wash your legs. If you decide to shave, shave. Especially when the summertime comes, at least shave. I mean, nair, whatever you decide to do. You know, don't forget the legs. And down to the feet. Wash your feet, man. When I was a little girl, I ain't gonna lie. I used to forget about my feet. I really did. <laughs> I really did. I just thought of it like, okay, I'm in the shower, I'm washing. When I get out the shower, my feet are made for walking. So I'm going to touch the floor. Nobody's floor is spotless clean. I don't care if grandma just swept, mop, all that, vacuum and everything. That's just where dirt is going to be. So my feet is automatically touching the floor. They gonna get dirty. Everybody wash your feet. Just keep them clean, I guess, even though we're about to step out the shower to get right on the floor. They are gonna get dirty anyway. But wash them. Um, also, the stuff that y'all eat can affect your face and your, your insides in general and, like, how you smell. Seriously, the, the stuff that you eat affects that. So, like, if you sitting here eating junk, 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 no vegetables and fruit and drinking water like i said that can mess up the insides how you smell everybody body does have 
a scent, their own scent. I don't want to say odor because when I hear odor, I think, mm. But everybody has their own body scent. And you might not always be like, oh, yeah, this is how I always smell. But if you get a, a scent and it's like, mm, something ain't right. Most likely something ain't right. So go to your neighbor's shower and get the washing. I feel like when somebody smells, you know that you smell. Like you have to know. Like you have to know. I feel like if you don't know, then that means you always smell like that. If you don't know that you smell so bad, that means you just got used to the scent and it's like okay to you now. Now you don't smell what other people smelling. So when other people do tell you or whatever the case may be, you and you're like, what? Like, I don't smell anything. That means you done got so used to that, that nasty odor. Like, you just used to it. Seriously. Make sure y'all just washing y'all clothes right, too. And everything goes with it. Don't be wearing some tight clothes. can give y'all yeast infection. And that's just the end of my video. Honestly, y'all. I just want y'all to keep clean, especially during this quarantine. Please make sure you're washing yourself. It is very important to keep clean all times. If you're not smelling good, just know. Just know someone is smelling you. And if they're your friend, they're going to let you know if they're not. And yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe to my channel. Comment down below some new videos that I should post. I just got done filming my advice video so if you haven't watched that watch that um also make sure you guys follow me on instagram chit chat on there thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video bye